Hello and welcome. Silra is here with Conan Exiles. So I have done some stuff off camera, mostly farming some materials and so on. And I made myself a bed up there in my in my little house we built last time. Eh, made a box, crafted some some stuff, weapons, made yogs, cleaver, this thing, and, and so on. And mostly I have been just, you know, getting ready for the level 30 transition. Yes, I am a you know, one and a half levels away from it, which means right now we need brimstone. What do I mean by level 30 transition? Guess well, we go here. What, what happens at level 30? We unlock all of these things, including steel tools. So that happens at level 30. While well, in 31, these things are uh, So I am. I have a. I have um, preparation for, you know. Made, made the calculations for what, what what is the minimum amount of different materials I need for level 30, uh, at level 30, to be able to do all of those things. Including make uh, multiple furnaces, multiple uh, blacksmith benches, all of that stuff, uh, a sandstone mask, a wheel of pain, so on. Um, I'll put it here on the screen, somewhere, we will we'll see, and, and so on. Because... I have a, yes, I have another one for level 55 in case, if, before you ask, because, you know, at level 55, these things become available. So, there, there is that. Well, this is 56 and, and Carpenter is 57, but the, the general idea remains the same. So, uh, maybe, really, farm smarter, not harder. Prepare for the things you will need, especially if you have played the game for a while and you know exactly what you need. Just to give you an uh, give you an example of why I want to uh, do all of the, uh, have the materials for that ready instantly at level thirty. Right now, making iron reinforcements takes two iron bars. When I make an improved blacksmith bench, it takes only one iron bar. So I really only don't only want about the amount I need of these, otherwise I'm wasting iron bars. It's not like iron bars are very difficult to make, but why would I waste the extra ones? Anyway, 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 anyway. However, right now we need brimstone to prepare for the steel, and I want to start filling that thing up with some animals. So let's go, let's go get brimstone, that's the first thing. Go and get some brimstone for me. And you know what? I will leave the yog cleaver behind. I, sh I probably shouldn't be carrying the uh, the javelin and shield either. They're, those are extra weight. But eh well. You know what? Yeah, let's leave the yog cleaver behind. It's not like it weighs much, but it is some weight. I want to bring back a good amount of brimstone. I don't have to go back right away. Then again, I am not planning to go back. At level, like, at level 30, once we have sandstone mask, this is where we get our brimstone from. Or at least very likely get our brimstone from. Because that place is the place for brimstone. Amazing XP from the rock noses there. And... Oh, nothing but brimstone to mine. Anyway. So, I'm gonna go and get my brimstone from the cave right here. Right here. That's where I'm gonna go for my brimstone. It's an easily accessible cave with, with some humans in it. Such. So, why did I make a, a katana and the javelin and a shield thing? Oh. Because this is new. The agility weapons uh, is the thing. I wanted to try this out, which means we can actually spend some points here. Katana is an agility weapon. I, I actually double checked that before I made it and so on. I, the wiki has at this point been updated uh, at least mostly. Anyway, so I want to try this whole agility weapon thing out before I move on to the what I generally use, the strength weapons. Which are essentially now the strength weapons. Because I, I like my two-handed uh, swords. Or an axe and a shield. But I want to give the agility weapons a bash. 
Uh, not really planning to use bows right now. I will eventually test out bows. Like, that, that is happening. I will eventually try out bows as well. But I just, you know, did the whole archery play. Granted, archery play was before Age of Sorcery. So, I have no idea how good bows are now with the, with without needing to pump both accuracy and strength. Just pumping agility. At least assume it's just agility. So we will, I will I will try them out, but I, that's not a not a priority right now. It's not a priority right now. Okay, it's getting dark, which is going to make this a little annoying. Make this a little annoying. Let's do a little scouting in the same go. Where can I find baby hyenas? So I haven't been getting animal like animal followers for such a long time. I have no idea where the heck can I get the little ones. Right, let's let's try this out. Just remember not to do a uh, oh ow. Just remember not to do the. Okay, of course one of you has. Oh, what the heck? One of you has the goddamn daggers. Oh, that, that went down nice and fast. Can't see a damn thing. Okay, I can't really can't see a damn thing. I actually kind of like that, but I can't see a damn thing. Javelin works surprisingly well. I was not expecting that. Um, nope. Let's grab the pickaxe. I don't want to see if I can get bones out of these guys. Because I will need bones. For the whole yoga thing. Do you folks drop anything useful? Um, what? It's just left the legs behind. Yeah, I'm not taking hides with me right now. I mean, definitely not taking that either. This is what I'm here for. This is what I'm here for. Probably clear the first part of this, this place. Let's bandage up so we can continue clearing. That. Okay. Let's see if we can entice. That guy's blocked out, it looks like. Fine. Okay, so, uh, so Javelin's shield works, seems to work fairly decently. Of course, these are low level creatures, so essentially anything works. Okay, let's go dagger. Oh, it's a Kimmerian carpenter of all things. It's a carpenter from all the way from Kimmeria land. Okay. How am I taking this too much damage? Of course, because there is some asshole with daggers again. It's two assholes with daggers. Oh jeez, how did you hit me with that? What the heck is dark here? Okay. Need to make them miss me. Okay, that failed. Really hate fighting daggers. Daggers and shield and, and spears, the two things I really hate fighting. Okay, how how the blazes do the daggers miss that badly now? Okay, there we go. And I have the two archers on top. Yeah, I, I should have made you know upgraded da daggers. 
that fine. Fine, fine, fine. How am I... Like, I haven't used daggers for a while. That's one reason why I'm going to miss so much. These are these two archers, which is fine. Okay. I got... Absolutely got caught in that. And I, somehow, for some reason, I can't roll out if I'm getting comboed. And I don't... Now why? Because that, that didn't used to be a thing. Hmm. Maybe I'm just timing the roll wrong. It's very much a possibility. Okay. Believe me. Okay, combo me. Okay, never mind. I will I will work it out on, on some something else. Probably a, possibly a hyena. We need to go hunt go hunt some hyenas anyway. Um yeah, I don't need anything you have, but I will take your bone. You would have a medium armor helmet, but don't really care. Actually. Okay, never mind. I kind of wanted to see what what's the stat bonus on medium health. Yeah. Free food. I will have free food. More free food. Mm, and you don't have anything useful. Right, let's eat food. Toss that. Toss that. I'll keep the hides uh, until until I have to drop them because I get overloaded with brimstone. Let's find out if that happens. So I'm wondering if there is actually a reason to use anything else still than a heavy armor. One of the one of the reasons to use heavy armor in 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 um especially when not playing single player, when playing online, is that there's always going well not always but you're connecting to an online server, so the chances are that there is a little bit of a lag which causes you to take a hit that you might otherwise, you know, be able to just dodge out of or avoid in some other fashion. The chance is always there, and so you kind of need to be prepared to take a hit or two. Um, and that's where heavy armor kind of comes in, because... Even if you otherwise could avoid ever all the damage, then you get a little bit of a lag, and suddenly, suddenly, you're taking an extra hit, maybe two. Yeah, I don't want to go too far in there. I don't need to. I have two thousand brimstone on me right now. We almost hitting level thirty before I even get get to places. Anyway, right, let's go deposit this stuff. And then we can go grab some hyenas. Go grab some hyenas. Just need to need to get that all of that steel uh, ready to go as well. Need steel for sandstone mask, torturous table, and obviously all the steel tools. But the sandstone mask and uh, and the torturous table are the priorities for the steel. Sandstone mask allows me to get all the steel I want. I need sandstone mask obviously for the... To enter this. Was it shattered springs? I always want to call it noxious springs because it's like... It's poisonous. <laughs> so there is that. So I need sandstone mask. That's the priority. And also sandstone mask, mask just generally makes the play a little easier here in the desert. Because you can just stay outside while the, while the sandstorm happens. And do, keep doing your stuff. And also, a torturous table is needed to make the iron truncheon. If I, if and when I want to start getting, getting, getting some thralls captured, and that might, that might happen fairly early here. Once I get a wheel of pain up. Okay. Hello, all of you crazy uh, creature things. Hi there.
Don't mind me, I'm just passing to, through. I also got some salt. Oh, 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 right. Right, right, right. Uh, fluid press and stove are actually available before level 30. I think fluid press is 28 and stove is 29. Or the other way around. Yeah, I can actually check. Maybe, maybe not while I'm being chased by crazy things. Whichever way was it around, actually. Uh, out of curiosity. Let's just see here. The fluid press is 28, stove is 29, right? Oh, and stove required the... Yeah, always forget that the stove requires bonfire for some reason. Anyway. I could, I could technically build those, but I might just as well wait until level 30 and get the priority stations up first. Because the stove is not really a priority right now. I'm not heading off to the off to the, 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 the cold lands, where, which is where I would need the spicy food for from the stove. But yeah, this is a good amount of brimstone. Now, there is my fireball cauldron. I want the improved version so we can do this stuff with only using one tar each. It's going to be a thing. Uh, me 20 of these so I can refill my bandages. Let's salt here. On. And yeah, let's put the highs there. I, oh, right. I actually had all my bone here. Let's oh, to keep stacking it. Also, give me six of these. Because combat is happening on new soon. Yep. Yeah, on here. Um, give me some iron bars to repair stuff. Yeah, we, we are still a little bit away. Uh, actually, we have the uh, the amount of iron reinforcements I need, but getting some extras is, is always nice. Okay. Can you pull everything there? Thanks. So, what I need right now with me is the skinning knife. Yes, we go we go get ourselves some hyenas into the, into the animal pen. And we, we probably have to kill big, big hyenas for that in the area to get the, get the little ones. So I'm not seeing any little hyenas here. Just seeing a whole lot of, like, big violent hyenas. I think there was one uh, towards this arch there, the stone arch. And there are definitely uh, some along this river uh, beach Thing. So let's see if we can get like five, get five of those hyenas on. Five of those hyenas up. Okay, I'm seeing some hyenas here. Do, is there a little hyena? I think that, yeah, that, that's a little high in right there. Yep. So go and grab the little hyena and then fight the big ones after. Or some hyena pelts. You come with me. Aha! Damn it. Missed. Okay, this is working a lot better than I thought it would. A lot better. Hmm. 
Let's go put this put this hyena in the in the animal pen right now and then we will go find a few more. I think I just yeah, I just hit level 30, which means we can have this. Damage when attacking from behind. Well that's not happening all that much while I'm playing solo. Once I have like a like a pet or a thrall to help me out with it, then obviously. Yeah, I'm gonna get the hyenas first and then I'm gonna worry about the crafting stations. Getting the stations up and after that. Oh interesting idea. Speaking of hyenas, how good is hyena fur armor now? Hyena fur armor prior to Age of Sorcery uh, used to be. I don't remember how long this takes. I think this is like eight hours, something like that. Um, hyena fur armor prior to Age of Sorcery. It didn't used to have any stats, but it had a, um, like, it doesn't have any of these. At least I seem to remember it had none, none of these. But it had a higher armor value than other medium armors. You know what, maybe I hold on to the hyena pelts. And, and kind of figure out, maybe unlock hyena fur armor and see how good it is. That, that might be a thing. I don't need 500 high enough bells to make it though. I don't even remember how many I need. And uh, I think it was like 200 around there. To make this ad. And actually, it's going to be even less if I make it with the um, with the improved armor workbench. So definitely get the improved armor workbench up before I start making any more armors. Same with weapons, actually. Especially uh, before I do uh, steel weapons and uh, improve blacksmith, obviously, not armor. But um, get that up before I start making steel, uh, steel tools and steel weapons so that it takes less materials to do. Okay, so let's go run to the beachfront property and see about finding a couple more little hyenas. Want to fill it with hyenas and then see if I can get a greater one. Because right now I'm really curious how different are greater hyenas from regular hyenas? Like, is there any reason to use basic version still? Instead of just trying to grow all the all the greater versions. Alright. These things are all over here. Surprisingly... Surprisingly liking the javelin shield combination right now. Granted, I, I don't really like javelins because they are bloody heavy. They are not a very good throwing weapon because of that. They are bloody heavy. However, the javelin shield is working fairly decently right now. So I... I prefer Axe and Shield. I'll be honest, I just prefer Axe and Shield. But for us, uh, for us, uh, this whole uh, agility weapon then go, goes. Let's have a drink and a snack. Also need to start going around the Darfari camps then once I get to get myself to steal weapons and, and start slaughtering things for both Derke, upgrade both Derke to and Yorg shrines. I don't think there was any baby crocodiles here. Just trying to figure out where can I find little crocodiles. Okay, so. Uh, that's shale bags, don't care about shale bags. Give me oinas. Is that a little hyena? That looks like a little hyena. Right there. Oh, that's two of them. Oh, come on back. Come back here. Oh, 
Oh, yeah, the thing is, the thing is lost. There, I have it. Dodge did. Okay, this is this is this this javelin shield is working a whole lot better than I expected it to. A whole lot. Okay, we're almost over encumbered here. I think we'll run back these two hyenas. You know what? Let's fill up the inventory while we're at it. There was iron there. Some iron and some stone. Can never go wrong with having more bricks, because towards the level 55, 56, 57, where the next uh, set of uh, crafting stations become available, start needing a bunch of hardened bricks. And at that point, I don't really need the, the um, carpenters, the blacksmith benches at that point. What I need at that point are, are the... the, the ones which are fuel efficient versions of of these basic ones essentially furnaces um like like the furnaces i, I like to have the fireballs as well and all of, for for even less material usage the alchemy bench is obviously good as well and um the the, the tannery tannery is the other big deal Because having to grind, or rather farm, I suppose, the proper word, having to farm more bark is online. Being able to have a, have a nice and efficient tannery, which doesn't use much bark, is really, really good. Of course, the other ones are useful as well. But honestly, not as, you, not, not as needed as the like fuel-efficient furnace. Um... Tannery. You know, fireball cauldron and, and alchemy are, are kind of nice. Nice to have, but more more the furnaces and the tannery. At least uh, for me those take a priority. Anyway. But hey, that's uh, about 25 levels away. So not really not really worried about that for now. We can we can do a whole lot of farming and preparation for them until then and right now we even still need to get up these level 30 stations first. So focus on the immediate and then plan then once that's that's sorted and ready to go, then plan for this next stage. I'll probably make a small satellite base eventually towards uh, uh, City of Relic Hunters so that I can start getting thralls out of City of Relic Hunters. Bring a, basically just to make a very tiny, you know, hut there uh, to house uh, some 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 tools and toys and and uh, uh, a you know greater wheel of pain. That, that's the thing that's happening there. I think, I think we can start tossing high enough belts into the... No, I don't need to actually uh, start tossing high enough belts into the tannery. Oh, what the... the hell did you come from? Okay, with the five agility, actually my damage went up quite significantly. I killed him in a single combo. That was a surprising creature then. Guess maybe I wait for the improved tannery. Maybe I do that. Before I do any anything else. I think that might be reasonable. These things can still do their stuff right now. Because that's fine. Um Miles. Oh right, I had I had seeds and plant fiber. And let's uh, let's 
drop all of this feral flesh into that thing so there is no food to feed the damn things. Feed the little hyenas. Okay, let's go get two more. Let's go get two more. Maybe And maybe kill this set of hyenas so that I have a good amount of hyena pelts around. And also more feral flesh. Because... I seem to, I don't, I don't remember at all what you should feed to the, um, to the various pets, various, uh, animals. Do you have the highest chance for them to grow into the greater version? The only one I remember is hyena wanting feral flesh, because, you know, the whole cannibalistic hyena thing. They eat their own, <laughs> they eat the meat that they drop. For the rest of them, I don't remember, and I probably looked that up. For for at least the at least the ones I I want to uh, give a bash on, give a try. Not not in a rush with them, not in a rush with those. Um, they will they will they will eventually get around to it, or I will eventually get around to them. I still have to figure out how to unlock the sorcery as well, but that's. Not exactly the moment uh, priority at this moment. I will, I will figure the sorcery out. I will figure the sorcery out once, once. Once have a lot of things on hand, huh? So I bet. If I go this direction further towards the green, I, there is hyenas here. So I, I bet, I bet I can, I can find baby hyenas over there. There's also more hyenas. I didn't see any little hyenas on this, on this, uh, this little outcropping. Can I call it an outcropping? Not really. It's not really an outcropping. That is more of an outcropping. Or this thing, but anyway, let's call it a platform. <laughs> uh, little flat hill. Yes, 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 yes. So, which ones would I? I think I think the goal is first to get a greater hyena. Like, really? You want some of my javelin action too, huh? I want to try the katana out next, I think. Man, this is a little harder to aim on a creature which is that low on the ground, so I kept missing a few times. Alright, fine. But give me reptile hide then. Reptile hide that I can turn into leather. Which is good. Give me more leather. You can actually try and jump onto the... If I start getting good amount of leather, I can jump onto the better bandages. That would be real nice. That would be real nice indeed. Okay, I want two hyenas. Two baby hyenas, then the thing is filled. And then I'm hoping one of them turns into a greater hyena. Okay, so there is hyenas below me, but there is also hyenas over there. Let's just start over there and then work our way this way. Because uh, I seem to remember there is a small hyena over there always. I seem to remember. Let's see if I remember correctly, man. See, it has been so long since I last messed around with... with with pets. Animal versions, that is. Okay, this this whole javelin and shield thing is actually starting to grow on me. Okay, I'm not seeing a little high, you know. Oh yes, I'm. I am seeing a little high, you know, right there. Pick it up. Got it. To, 
Gazelle baby is just lo just you know looking on as I slaughter hyenas like. Eh, ain't not, not a danger anymore. <laughs> okay. So I have one. No I need a uh, need a second one. You know what? Let's let's keep this javelin shield thing going. This is working pretty dang well actually. Surprisingly so. Not really surprising considering I love my pike, but I am I, I'm not really keen on the javelin thing. It's just a thrown weapon and not oh well. Is there a little hyena here? Is that the glowing bad guy hyena that one? That might be the glowing bad guy hyena. Yes, yes it is, and I'm not seeing a little hyena here. Damn it. Yeah, where would I find... I don't wanna, wanna try to take on the big hyena right now. Where would I find another little hyena then? Fill my water skin in the same go. Maybe up there. Or maybe the first hyena, little hyena I grabbed um, has respawned by now. That's also a very much possibility. You will probably check that if I can find one here. Or then I then I simply didn't see uh, see it. It was hidden somewhere, but at least for now, it's a hyena eating. Okay. Where the heck did that hyena come from? So, there should be hyenas up here. Yes, there are. But is there a, like a little hyena along there? Yeah. You want, you want some, don't you? Bash your head on this. Missed me. Night time is falling on us. Well, give me those horns. I need horns. Okay. You don't happen to have a little one along with you, do you? Nope. I'm not seeing one. So screw you. I'm going somewhere else. Ah, missed me. There's another hyena there. I'm again still not seeing a little one. Hmm. This is mildly annoying. This is a little annoying indeed. Do you happen to have little puppies with you? <laughs> oh. There! That's a little one, right? Haha! <laughs> Got it! Bye! Man, there's an entire goddamn hyena pack on me now. Well, I suppose I'm stealing their babies, so... Don't worry, I will I will feed you eventually. To, to one which I have grown. I promise to come back! <laughs> Let you play. Man, this is. <laughs> this is. Ow! Okay, fi finally one hit me and managed to cripple me. I was trying to do the whole run, run zigzag like a lunatic. You know. Okay, finally there all gone home. <laughs> Run zigzag like a lunatic so they all miss. Miss their jumps. One one managed to head. Alright. That went that went well enough. And now I have two two little hyenas. Well enough. Now let's go home. Let's go home and, and prepare prepare those Repair those, those, those crafting stations. 
And a wheel of pain. Definitely a wheel of pain as well. Hopefully those things are really easy to see in the dark thanks to the glowing eyes, huh? Yes, yes, go away. Go away now. I have more feral flesh. I have savory flesh, which we can turn actually turn into uh, dried meat again. Yeah, let's do that. That gives me more food sitting around. I should. What's what was the level for? It was 40, 43 for preservation box. All right. So basically, as soon as we hit level forty three, we will run off into into the the. the into the northern tundra on this side because there is some black ice in here and some ice and we will make, come home and make preservation boxes make a few of them and then we don't have to worry about the food going bad on us okay that we don't need those there put more feral flash there i think this is overkill on feral flash i'll take a few back yeah, i'll take a few a few of those back Right, now let's prepare for the transition to the steel stuff. Um, yeah. Those the here. Those here. Actually, at this point, we can turn... Turn these off. And what will happen is... Um, hmm. Oh, yeah. You do your job. That's That's what you do. I'll store this stuff here for now. Man, I do have a lot of hides. We may we may end up turning some of the hides into other things, huh? All right, let's let's uh, switch a uh, switch a rule to the better things. Leave stuff here which has a little bit more of a weight. I don't need all of these bandages on me either. Give me my construction hammer. And let's get cracking. After I first unlock this stuff. Steel tools. There we go. So furnace. I should have the points for this. Just go in the order of importance to make sure. Alright, I have 13 points left over. Anything. That means we can get the stove and the fluid press. Okay, then I have a few points left over. Anything else I do want or need right now? I could get these, but nah. That, that can wait a little. Um, oh, bloody heck, I don't have the points for improved armor. Oh, that... Oh, that sucks. I should not have taken the... Yeah, I should have double-checked first. I should not have grabbed the uh, Lloyd Perez and the stove. Or one of which one of one of them. Oh that that's really annoying. Well, we are kind of close to a level up, so we can get the level up from just farming. Uh, right, I need the materials, right? I need uh, the, uh, the material, right? So first of all, let's uh, set up the furnaces. Furnaces, furnaces, furnaces. No, we want 300 iron bars. Um, also, you can you can stop now. We will do the rest in a in a better in a better uh, fireball. Right. So two furnaces and 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 three uh, well three furnaces and two fireballs, which is to say. This, that's the materials I need for them, for, for these, and then I need, what, 250 barracks, right? Okay, so that, that will uh, settle those, and we're gonna 
I'm gonna do this in batches because I kind of want to want to sort of figure out where the heck am I placing them before I really start. Okay. So I'm thinking this here, this edge here, turn it into kitchen area. Or then I will put the, like the kitchen maybe here. Who knows? Who who knows? Um Okay, so this is where the wheel of pain goes. So maybe back here is where I do my furnace. Is this for now? Furnace is there. For now. Yeah, yeah, we will we will make this place bigger eventually. But for now let's do like three furnaces here. That's three furnaces. Uh, give me the fireball cauldrons. I, you know what? Two fireball cauldrons and... Oh, let's get the alchemy bench between the two of them. Yeah, never mind. Let's do two fireball cauldrons and then an alchemy bench here. Okay, that, that's not exactly going very straight, is it, huh? Let's, uh, let's, let's, let's do this well. Correctly, since we are doing it anyway. Um, where was it? Fairness. Put them, put them towards the back edge, right? This. This. Leave a little space between them, like that, and then the fireball. Okay. Now those are set up. Next thing's next. Mm. So let's yeah, let, let's do fifty breaks, fifty iron reinforcement. That's uh, that's the uh, improved alchemist, and then I want the improved blacksmiths, which is a uh, couple hundred bricks and a couple hundred of these, and a couple hundred bricks. You know what? I'm gonna walk up there while being over encumbered. Guess I'm gonna get these things to do their stuff in the same go. Leave uh no 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 what the heck am I doing? What the heck am I doing? Right, yeah, yeah, yeah. let's do that. And also pick up everything from here in the same go. Now no, wait, 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 wait. I forgot the iron bars. Because I need to start making the steel now as well, right? So I forgot the iron bars for the steel. Grab. Grab that amount. Suppose. Suppose that will work. Um, I think I have all the iron reinforcements I need. Stop that nonsense. Alright, so this is going to take a moment of walking to get up there right like this. Which gives me a, mo a, a chance to plan a little. Because, uh, should I extend extend these these a bit? I think I want to extend this uh, that way by one, maybe? Yeah, I probably don't need to. I'll just put like a uh, furnace, uh, not furnace, a brazier on this bed here. And then a brazier on this as well but up here uh, this I might extend outwards by one the brazier on it and have somebody here standing guard duty eventually how 
How would I get braziers up here, though? Maybe I'll just have to uh, figure a way to get like a um, like a lamp or something underneath this the staircase, so there's some light while I'm climbing up. That is probably the thing to do at this point. Yeah, I have I have good amount of, of uh, amount of stuff for my furnaces. So um, let's make sure we get. Spread out the lava here. There we go. Just split this. Okay. That's reasonable. And you can start start with this. Get me my steel. You can start with uh, that. And let's do this here. Go. Fantastic. And then what happens is make steel fire. And you make steel fire. Alright. This is this is why I wanted two fireball cauldrons because it gets me stuff faster. Uh, and those are those are not that difficult to make. And now we are starting to get our steel bars as well. And now now no 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 no. Uh alchemy bench. Yeah. What? Oh, 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 I forgot to shape it wood. Shape wood. Yes, of course I did. Yeah. But I have improved blacksmith, which is a... You know what? I'll put the blacksmith and the carpenter's bench here for now. And then worry about what, what to do with the rest. Well, worry about where I eventually move them around to, I suppose. Damn it, I forgot to shape wood for the alchemy bench. Huh. Oh well. Ow. That hurt. That hurt my ankles. So, uh, 50 shape wood for the alchemy bench. What did I need for a carpenter as well? Um, Another 50 shape wood, right? Yep. Another 50 shape wood. Some iron reinforcements. I think 25. I think I'll take those with me. And actually use them to make more iron reinforcements upstairs. And... And, 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 and... Oh yeah. Another 100 barracks. Which I have somewhere. Here we go. You know what? I should be able to carry the rest of the... Rest of this stuff up. Now. Aha! Awesome. We can slowly take, take stuff upstairs as well while I do this. And I will dismantle all the old stations after I am done here with this. With this movement uh, of into the new better stations. Right, so give me carpentry bench. Smack it right there. And then the, then the improved alchemist bench. Right there. Um, what else? What else? What else? I would have some stuff with me. You know what? Let's do it this way so that this is this goes nice and easy. Start with that. Right. Auto reinforcements and that stuff up here. Now we should probably make a box up there and move all of the other stuff. And get up the improved tannery as well. Improved tannery, which requires bark. No, for that, that for a fact. A 75 bark, um, 50 shape wood, 50 twine. 50 shaped wood, 50 twine, it didn't require Perex, okay, right, I, I thought it required Perex, I'm just remembering things wrong, right, and, 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 I had, yeah, I had the 150 stones there sitting around for, for that stove, 
Your stove requires those things and iron reinforcements. And what else? What else? Right. Um, Torturous work table re needs the steel bars. We're waiting on those. And. Um, oh, right. Fluid press. Fluid press. We can we can do set up the fluid press as well. So that was like what ten twine, ten twine. Um, hmm. Oh right, it's also also shaped wood. Fifty shaped wood. I, I I mean I could just take everything upstairs and then mess around, but right now because I need to run back and forth anyway here, I might as well do it. Do it in, in the way which is which makes sense. So all of this stuff is ready. I can actually take all of this stuff upstairs. Now leave those here for the moment. And I have a carpenter's bench up there. So let's take some stuff up. Aha! Okay. You can leave leave all the wood and why not in the carpenter's bench. I have enough shaped wood. I can actually Yeah, I could I could let it do deal with this insulated wood now. That's actually pretty nifty idea. So it can actually do something with its time around here now. Uh fluid press. Actually, let's make the stove next to it first, and then do the fluid press and a grinder. That's another thing I haven't made. Um, it was in general, right? There is a dryer now. Where the heck was it? Oh, it's in the alchemy. Okay, fine. Do the fluid press. Fluid press is a little less necessary at this point. I don't really need that so badly. And then I want the tannery. Oh, I got my borax. How, how do I keep forgetting borax? Uh, didn't I bring borax up, up here? I guess I didn't. What the heck? Oh, there they are. Eh. There they are. There are my breaks. And how is improved tanner in the bloody smithing? That's what I want to know. Okay. Very good. Very, very, very good. You know what? Few things can be here. Thank you. Now let's start dragging stuff upstairs so that I can I can fill those up. And also... Hmm. Get up the wheel of pain. Get up the wheel of pain. I'm gonna move this up so we have that there, and uh, the tanner's table definitely gets moved up because that thing, there is no improved version of it, so we can move that up upstairs entirely. Um, same thing with the drawing rack. We can just move that. Uh, move the bark. Eh. Right, what else we do we have? Yeah, we still have like a thousand bricks down here and whatnot. Alright, we're almost almost set up on the new, with the new crafting stations. We'll, we'll eventually move them around a little once I start uh, expanding this thing a little. Make this a little bit bigger. Maybe I'll, I'll add, add this this thing so that it reaches basically here. And I will add a, like a corner here. Make this a little bigger. I'll extend this that way. And probably extend this like all the way here as well then I have then I have a good amount of space to do to do the big big crafting stations as well 
and I want uh, I want, want another as I mentioned I want another religious shrine over there and I want all, one over there as well maybe maybe like run one of the religious shrines from here here and then we might be able to fit one actually in between that one and this one like right right here I think that's a that's a decent enough plan maybe I'll yeah I'll put one shrine here first and then figure out the like how how far from that I do I have to be like is it like around here somewhere you have a, yet another shrine yeah, because I want all the shrines up here well not all of them but I want I'm not building Yumira Shrine here, I don't think. I think Yumira Shrine is uh, is the one we build up in the north when we make the base in the north. Anyway, I'm gonna go do the rest of this moving and whatnot. Uh, so thank you very much for watching. I will see you folks next time with more Conan Exiles.